approaching a no-wake zone. That's what those buoys are for. So we're going to slow down, give everybody a break. We don't, we're not allowed to create any kind of commotion for other boats or people who are on the shore, people who are anchored and fishing like those two boats over there. And when you have a boat, you are responsible for your wake. So if you cause anybody problems or damage or injury you're gonna you're gonna be in trouble for that so we slow down everybody loves boating what a beautiful day Betty always cheats when we come fishing. So she caught the first fish, and it's a nice one. Put him back gently so he doesn't die. For some reason, this lake is full of dead fish. There's dead fish in it everywhere. And I don't believe for one second it has anything to do with the fishermen. Some of them are going to be because the fisherman doesn't handle them well. But it was really a lot of them, wasn't it? It was a lot of them, wasn't it? Yeah. I mean, from the last time we started the boat fast, so we stopped right down there, I thought it was 15. Yeah. It wasn't even a mile. Oh, I got a nice fish on, guys. Yeah. You got the net there? Uh, that's in the back. Hold on. Fish on. You have to bring him in without the net, man. Look at him fight. Look at him fight. Woo! He's angry. What'd you do, Tracy? You pissed him off. Oh, it's a nice little bass. Yeah, yeah, net him, please. I don't want to lose him. Oh, he's a dandy man. We're fishing for crappie and perch. That's a beautiful largemouth bass there. He wouldn't be legal. He'd have to be uh, at least 12 inches, I think. He's uh, 11 inches long. He's, le he's 11 inches long. They need to be 12. But it needs to be seasoned, and it's not. Whoa, Betty's got a nice bass. Unbelievable. Look at that beautiful fish, Betty. Yeah. Isn't it perfect? It is. The fish is perfect. Down. All right, Betty has two and two species as well. Because yep. she cheats. On me. Yeah. Now I have two species as well as Betty. And Tracy has a bunch of fish she caught. <laughs> Tracy's giving me a dirty look. Poor Tracy has not caught a fish. She will. Everybody catches fish here. You need to knock it off. Look at that pretty fish. It's beautiful. I'm going to get my tool to get the you hook out. The yep, got one right here. <laughs> Tracy, you actually caught a fish. Not a fishy. They said it couldn't be done. That's a beautiful fish. Oh, Ooh, don't nice. abuse him. Get him back in there quick. That's nice. Oh, everybody has fish now. Whee. Now, Tracy caught a bass. <laughs> so we We've all caught a nice largemouth bass. Tracy's got two. Bye-bye, Fishy. Whoa, he didn't want to hang out with us. 
You're gonna need more bait. Congratulations, Tracy. Yeah, too. You're a real fisher person now. Okay, he's got a nice fish. Okay, don't reel on them too much more. A little bit more. A little bit more. I'm not reeling. Reel a little bit more. You want to get to where you're about that far away from the fish. That's it. Oh my goodness, that's a nice big bass. Look at him. Okay, let him get tired. Let him get tired. He's 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 uh. That big. He's still green, they'll say. Because he's not ready to come home yet. Look at that thing. Holy that God. is exactly what I was talking about before. That is a nice, big, smallmouth bass. And he's got my hook out of his mouth. I know that's my weight down there. Look at, Look at you that. You barely had him. But you got him in the right place, yeah. in the top of his mouth. Oh my God, that's awesome. Mm -hmm. You want to get him. All right. But he is all of 15 and a quarter inches. Almost 15 and a half. Well, I got a fish on this little lure here. Not the one I expected. I switched to this little swimming lure here, and it's not a swimming lure, it's a, it's a crankbait. In the hopes of catching some bass. I got this guy. He was hungry. There is a pretty fish. This is a white crappie. It's a nice one. You can tell it's white crappie because he's trying to develop these stripes going up and down. They're not very prominent right now. Yep. Sure. Well, I've got four, or do I have five? Four. Or do I have three, Betty? Oh, jeez. Well, I am a fisherman, so nobody expects me to tell the truth. It's the middle of the day. They're not biting fast, but they're biting regularly. And we've all caught a few fish now. Four for me. Tracy has four. Betty has the most species, and she has the biggest fish. First fish. First fish. Well, nobody likes her. She's got the trifecta, that's right. First, biggest, and most species. That's a nice a fish, a mamma mia. Nice fish. Good job, Tracy. There's a teensy one. We're all catching fish at once now. I just had a bass on and I was doing something else and I didn't catch him. He got away. Beautiful fish. Okay. Tracy's killing the, the crappie now. This is number seven for her. Nice. He took off in a hurry. He did. Betty's got a nice one there. Little crappie. Yep, little guy. See the lines? Up and down. It's a white crappie. Bye, Fishy. Oh, I have another species. So I have three species now. Boy, that little tiny fish is only a little bit bigger than my lure, and he just nailed it. All right. The fish. If we were eating him, I could eat him. But he is kind of small. Bye bye, fishy. Good job. But he's got another one. Oh, it's a nice big one, too. Yeah, good job, Betty.
5 o'clock was my first meal today. I meant to eat earlier, but I left my food in the car. This is tuna. I'm on a diet. But I can eat anything I want. I can't live on potato chips and candy bars and soda pop, but within reason I eat anything I want. I'm intermittent fasting. And I've lost 14 pounds. I only eat during an eight hour window that begins late morning and ends in the evening. So I don't eat for 16 hours and then I eat whatever I want during those eight hours. And what happens is, just because there's less time, you eat a little bit less. That window ends. Aside from that, I've become accustomed to eating far smaller portions. So maybe I'll live to do a few more videos, catch a few more fish.